Aikido is partner to Tai Chi and that's exactly what it is meant to be. Saying that is not putting down Aikido, it's upholding what O Sensei Morihai Shiba intended Aikido to be. O Sensei himself would tell you if you were like, yeah, I use Aikido for fighting, then he would tell you, you use it wrong. And yeah, you, I, I can use a screwdriver as a hammer, but it's a bad tool for that. It's good to use it as a screwdriver and as a hammer, please take a hammer. So don't use your iPhone as a hammer, even though you could use it. And it's the same. I love Aikido. I'm not practicing it, but I'm practicing some Tai Chi and Qigong and it's great. But I would never go and tell somebody, yeah, practice Tai Chi and then go fight a pro MMA fighter on the street even. And I would never go and tell somebody, yeah, we're practicing without rules. So you're definitely going to beat a professional fighter. It, that's all lies. Those are great system. It's like you should learn how to swim. It's going to save your life one day. And I will not tell you that with Aikido you will learn how to swim and I will not tell you that with, if you learn how to swim you can drive a car or uh, fly an airplane after. I'm gonna be very honest and upfront and that is fundamentally important and everybody who's lying deserves to be exposed as a liar and their systems being, um, let's say, corrected in what they are. So the people know what they will get when they practice that systems. Because yes, styles do matter. Everybody who's going to tell you that styles don't matter is either trying to avoid any conflict or is a liar or is naive up to the point that he's very much unfit to be a trainer if he doesn't even know how much styles even matter.